All right, here's a quick demonstration on the Bistronics Bilar Brake press brake software for offline bending. I've taken my SolidWorks model and saved it off as an ASUS SAT file so I can bring it into the Bistronics software. And I've got the bending part 3D. The top tool warning here is just because I don't have my top tool set as a default yet. Haven't been running the software all that long. But uh, so we're going to go ahead and open a file. And I'm going to grab my part that I just saved. It's a very simple part. And we're going to go ahead and give it a quick unfold. We're going to go ahead and use the default and change. And then I'm going to click on my tools. I've got a gooseneck and a 362 die, gooseneck punch. That's a 362 die with wheel of tooling. And it shows me here it's red that uh, it's not quite sure how the bend allowance is going to come out. Again, we haven't built up the database very well for this yet. And I'm just going to say OK. So now I've got my flat blank and I'm going to take that into the by bend part software. And I'm just going to hit first off I'm going to go ahead and uh, hit automatic technology and it solved that pretty quick and now I'm going to go to my punches my bending sequence I mean and we're going to click on the normal bending I'm going to click this and I'm going to rotate my punch just because that's the way it's already set up in the press and I'm trying to minimize setups on this here so I'm going to go ahead and edit this one as well. So we'll flip that one around. Then I'm going to go ahead and check on my back gauges, how it uh, came up with a solution for that. So there's bend one. There's bend two. And we'll look at our tooling. Let's go ahead and have it come up with a plan for this. So we'll go automatic setup plan. I'm going to delete the existing setup plan. And there, it just gave me a couple of punches right there in the middle. And then we've got our calculation here. And that's all there is to it. Now I just need to save this off to the shop, which I can go File, Export, Bistronics BPX. And I'm going to go ahead and give it the file name there. Save that. And then I can go ahead and uh, hit Print, and I'm going to get a print page of uh, all the setup sheets.